Hey guys, this is Robert. I'm going to show you guys a quick tip when it comes to the APC-40 and mapping for it. I know that the people are using dumb mode or uh, regular mode uh, by launching um, Ableton and then getting that into dumb mode. Um, I personally just stick with uh, regular mode and you can map away and still get LED feedback, knob um, halo feedback and everything just by doing it that way and, and it saves you guys from, especially me, it saves me from having to load up, you know, load up Ableton and then having to close it and then to do all that which I think is kind of ridiculous to try to actually do out in a live set. Anyways, so uh, pretty much all you have to do is just turn on your APC-40. When you turn on your APC-40 for, you know, uh, for the first time, you're going to get a little green light here. Um, I don't have Ableton running at all, but uh, all you have to do is just select your master and then start up your, your uh, tractor. So I just selected tractor going to pop up and your pretty much the APC start lights up and that's pretty much it guys um, as long as the as long as uh, the master selected um, you can you can map away and get get LED feedback uh, pretty much get everything that you need whatever mapping you did um, so when you're mapping uh, all your MIDI assignments make sure that that button is selected and you're good to go um, so, uh, just to kind of give you guys, here, it's just kind of showing you guys that I pretty much mapped out all my stuff. Um, uh, that's actually a super effect, and that's, that's another effect. Anyways, um, and just to show you guys that uh, this does work, uh, we'll put a little dot of life, I guess. Um, uh, let's see. And pretty much I have mine set up where... Um, the first top ones are going to be uh, my hot cues, and these are my loop sizes for deck A, and then obviously for deck B over here. And so I have my play here and stuff. So just so you can see, um, make sure I'm not too loud here. Uh, and so that's about it, guys. So hopefully this helps out people. Um, by the way, if you do happen to if you do happen to go back to another, um, if if one of the uh, the track selection does go to an, any other channel besides the master, then uh, um, all you have to do is just go back to your master, and your lights come back on. So let me just quickly show you. That's how you know that the mapping has just changed. So you go onto here, and then yeah, I did all these feedbacks. Alright guys, hopefully that helps. Oh, and if you guys are interested, I did uh, put this APC um, TSI up on DJ Tech Tools too, so hopefully you guys enjoyed that. Bye.